Alexandra Park, star of E! drama series The Royals, has issued a statement indicating that she experienced harassment and misconduct from creator Mark Schwann similar to that being alleged by the stars and crew of Schwann's previous series, One Tree Hill. I have a responsibility as someone who is working under Mark Schwann on The Royals to acknowledge these claims, Park said in a statement posted on Twitter Wednesday. I am devastated to admit to myself, to my colleagues, and to this industry that I too, have been exposed to this reprehensible behavior. Park's statement came two days after 18 women who worked in front of and behind the camera on One Tree Hill sent a letter to Variety accusing Schwann of years of sexual harassment. On Wednesday, Schwann was suspended from his role as showrunner on The Royals, which is produced by Lionscape Television and Universal Cable Productions. The fourth season of The Royals, which wrapped shooting in September, is scheduled to premiere in March. On Saturday, former One Tree Hill writer Audrey Waco took to Twitter to recall incidents of alleged harassment and misconduct perpetrated by Schwann, who she initially did not identify by name, during her time on the show. Waco described being subjected to frequent and unwanted touching by Schwann, who she did not identify by name. Seeing Schwann show naked photos of an actress that he was having a sexual relationship with to staffers without the actress' knowledge, and Schwann calling Wachope's writing partner into his office to try to talk her out of getting married and into dating him. In the letter released Monday, the actors and crew members wrote, Many of us were, to varying degrees, manipulated psychologically and emotionally. More than one of us is still in treatment for post-traumatic stress. Many of us were put in uncomfortable positions and had to swiftly learn to fight back, sometimes physically, because it was made clear to us that the supervisors in the room were not the protectors they were supposed to be. Many of us were spoken to in ways that ran the spectrum from deeply upsetting, to traumatizing, to downright illegal, and a few of us were put in positions where we felt physically unsafe.